Hi all, welcome back to PE on the farm. To succeed at farming, you do need to do more than cast into the breeze with the open mouth. You need to be healthy and fit, just like me. So today's episode, we're going to do some ninja training. Whoa, hold on, come back, come back, come back. Oi, oi, put the knife and the nunchucks down. Not that type of ninja training. We're talking ninja warrior type, on an obstacle course. Come with me and I'll show you what I mean. Alright, before we get started in actual planning, we'll have to think about what we have at home and around the farm that we might be able to use in our obstacle course. Got it. Let's have a look what we have. The secret to a good course will have speed, agility, it'll have strength, it'll have jumping, it'll have balancing, all sorts of different things. Variety is the spice of life. Now before you go ahead and make your course and undertake it, you'll need to go to a responsible adult and get them to check. Remember, if you break your leg when you're a farmer, you'll farm in circles. Now that you've planned your course, checked it with mum and dad, and set it up, time to have some fun. See how fast you can go. Go! Hope you got that. Okay guys, I hope you have fun with your ninja courses. Uh, I wouldn't mind seeing some of your plans. Remember you can use things like your swing set or your slippery slide or any other thing you have at home. But double check with your parents first to make sure it's nice and safe. We don't want anyone getting injured. Of course, if you've got a brother or sister at home, you might take turns designing the course and challenge each other. Good luck with it. Oh, stay tuned for next week when we'll find out if mixed up chickens lay scrambled eggs. Bye all. Okay. 
working. <laughs> oh, far out. That's on. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, and when you're ready. <laughs>